this is like regular fireworks. This July 4th, 10-year-old Lily Mueller is celebrating her independence from cancer. This time last year, we were watching fireworks over um, the Charleston Bridge from her transplant room. Just a year ago, she was sent home from the hospital out of options after doctors thought a bone marrow transplant had failed. Six months later, a different story. We're like a normal family. We're having friends over. We're going to play cornhole. We're going to do fireworks. Um, my older two are going to have their friends over. So I mean, we're, we're going to be, an, again, as normal as this family can be. I'm excited about tonight, being able to blow stuff up. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> That's why this summer, while everyone's shooting fireworks, Lily's family is doing that and planning another kind of celebration. We're going to have a port party and we're just going to say bye cancer and just be grateful. Lots to celebrate. And I tell you, you really do celebrate everything. You, you really don't take it for granted. A port party, celebrating the removal of Lily's port and the end of chemo. So like if it gets a lot of pressure on it, it really hurts, so like the most, that's why you can't do like, like if you want to like, like pretend like to wrestle with your friends or anything, you can't really do that because if I have the slightest pressure on there, it really hurts. Oh, trying to get a little sneaky. That means Lily can get back to doing the things she loves like wrestling and of course, baseball. Allison Powell, WYFF News 4 in Greenville. No.